see the capability of several CAD softwares in freeform surface modeling. Note, this is cutted out video tutorial. Realize shape in Siemens NX. Imagine and shape in CAT EA. Freestyle in PTC Crow. Power surfacing plugin in SolidWorks. Free form in Autodesk Inventor. And Clay U plugin in Rhino. Okay. Realize shape in Siemens NX software. First in menu bar, insert, NX realize shape. Subdivision level, by default is base, change it to first and see it in graphic window. Again change it to second, and see it, and increase its segments, linear X, linear Y and linear Z, do that and complete the job. Also you can see the mirrored new face. Test it more and more, try to do it and complete the job. Next method is transform, select it. You can move and rotate your desired face. Now in dialog box, in select object, you can select face, edge or point and transform it. Let's do it. First select a point in top, change the method to transform, move it and see its operation, OK. Also you can rotate it. Now test the translation and rotation tools to the selected edge and see its operation on graphic window, OK. In the following test other primitive shapes and test the translation and rotation tools on it, it's so good. Make enough points and lines and you can see the operation of this command in graphic window, so good. And now in tool palette, move point, edit the revolved shape surface and enjoy it, absolutely strong tool. Increase or decrease the number of section, try to do it and complete the job, and apply the command, between this methods of extrusion, ok, it's so good. Next command is merge, we have to open cylindrical shapes, find and run the merge command and then,
freestyle in PTC Creo software, to start this environment click on its icon, it's here, ok, now in operations, test it on X, Y, and Z direction, and you can see the power of this command, test it more and more, move this selected edge to all three directions, ok, rotate the model and see completely the new style of your current shape, ok, undo, and start to this job, it's very simple and so powerful, enjoy it, ok, it's very good. Run it and move the arrow, now you can see the extrusion new shape on sphere, try to do it and test it in graphic window and now, undo and back again, now we want to explain the connect command, first select two faces, do it with control button, and the run the connect command and you can see the operation of this command. Ok now we want to explain the power surfacing plugin in the SolidWorks software. First start with the create command series. Create box is the first. Click and run it. For example change it to 3. And you can see the changes on your surface shape and boundary curves. And finish it and you can see the result surface model ok select this face and run the command in the distance type 100 millimeters in number of sections type the 7 rotation angle of extrusion increase this item to twist the model around its vertical axis also with drag the green arrow on the graphic area you can do it. Do it more and more. And see the changes. Ok. Now using the power surfacing commands to complete this tutorial. Now freeform in Autodesk Inventor software, in 3D model tab, in ribbons, create freeform, its list is here. First command is box, run it and then select a plane, and then, here, select a point as center point of box. And now you can see the box preview, in dialog box, here is length width, and height, ok, so good. You can write your desire values on each one, also you can increase the number of faces in each direction. And in graphic window, you can use this handles to increase or decrease the length, width and height values. Also you can use the soft modification parameters. Let's start. Enjoy it.
try to do it and complete the job, do it and finish the process and then run the thicken command, ok, good. Now in dialog box. Do it and complete the selection, it's so good. Ok. And in target, select this 2D sketch, and see the result, ok. OK, Clue is a plugin for Rhinoceros software. Clue converts your imaginations to the 3D model with its freeform tools, and change its radius values in X, Y and Z directions. Try to do it and complete the job, also in segments. Test all of them and finish the process. Cancel the command and next is cone and truncated cone, OK. Run it and test both of them completely, increase its segments and edit it. OK the command and with the arrows move it to this place, complete the movement and finish the process. Next command is sweep to, run it and then. Select first rail, and then select second rail, OK, so good. And then select first profile, and select second profile. Now you can see the result sweep preview here. Edit its segments and then OK the command and check it out completely, OK, it's so good. Try to do it and complete the job and check it out more and more in graphic window. OK the command and. Next is extract ISO curve. Do it for top view, and front view, side and back views. Complete the selection and finish the process. But first with this two icons you can change the visibility of objects in Clayu plugin, click more and more. And test this icons and select the best situation, first select vertex, and on this box, select several points and then with this arrows. Drag and move them and see its operation. Change the selection mode to Edge and then repeat movement. Check it out in graphic window and test it more and more.